Good morning, children. How are you? We are from the Yamaji Nation, which goes throughout the Midwest. And first of all, I'd like to say uh, we've got to pay our respects to the elders of this land, past and present, and the future, which is you children. And I'm very proud to be here to welcome you all to this uh, Allendale Pool, which is in the Willingu country. Thank you very much. The story of the Bimara that I have been taught is that he protects the water holes. He feeds all the water holes, lakes, rock holes around the whole of WA in our, in our side of the country. So he brings the water. The circles that you see on my, my painting, my map, is the, where he's dropped water in the rock holes. He comes along, he drops the water there. He doesn't go back there but he knows the water's there and he travels around. It's like blessing all the water holes. The Bimara here lives over there in the rocks. Right underneath there's a cave in that rock formation that we don't like people to go under there and, and explore it, you'll get sick. This is why when you come to a water hole and a big one that you think you're going to swim in, you always got to pick up some sand and throw in and let him know that you're there. Just say to him that, hello, I've come to have a swim in your rock hole. It's just plain respect to the Bimra. Yeah, the importance of that, throwing sand into a um, waterway, or a spring water hole in this area where you come from is just to let the older people, the spirits of our generation, know that we've come here to visit them and um, <clears throat> because this water probably been laying here for thousands of years and our ancestors would have came here and drank and now that they've passed on but their spirits are still here and they would like to know who we are and where we come from and if we got connections to them. great emotion for me to see so many children, Aboriginal and non-Aboriginal, singing in the same tune and waving their hands and I just hope they grow up to be good citizens and just grow up to be friends, you know, where there'll be no dividing amongst them. And, you know, if it happens again, I'd love to be here again.